This ape says I challenge every single ape to buy at least one item this Christmas. I did my part, now do yours. Come on, guys. We got to sell out a whole site. Let's go. Who's with me? So this is in regards to AMC's merch, AMC's gift cards. There's so many ways to support AMC. We talked about this last year, apes. Make sure to do your part. This tape says AMC. The earnings were fantastic, and the next quarter will be great too. AMC is exposing massive manipulation on a grand scale. And with this, the market makers have enjoyed skimming the average investor for a long time now. Infinite liquidity needs to go, or better known as infinite counterfeit shares. AMC, AMC never leaving. This tape says you could not ask for a more obvious, amazing setup. This price action has me extremely excited for how this fractal size will play out percentage-wise down the road. It can be known I'm doing it live with you. AMC, apes together strong. This is pretty insane. It says Justice Department closes in on short sellers. Let's take a look. It says FBI agents raided the homes of prominent short sellers last year. Now criminal charges may be imminent. The meme stock bear. Andrew Left, a hedge fund manager famous for shorting meme stocks, was one of the short sellers whose home was raided. As I predicted at the time, his investors have pulled out. Again from Bloomberg. Two years after the FBI agent showed up to the California home to seize computers and phones, the short seller who terrorized more than 100 companies and riled an army of meme stock traders is describing what it's like to feel hunted. His pioneer firm, Citron Research, no longer has investors. He's all but stopped pitching ideas publicly. He even wiped his once-feared Twitter accounts. The Justice Department has not made any specific allegations against Left. No one has proven he's guilty of anything. But Left's short positions have already cost him clearly. He took massive losses shorting GameStop in 2021 and finds himself ostracized in the industry and personally. But what is the government looking for? Short sellers typically short a stock. They publish a negative article or research report. Then profit when the shares fall. When the Justice Department has not said what exact wrongdoing they're looking for. They may be digging into these reports and they may be trying to build a case. How it ends, I find it hard to believe that the government will spend years investigating an industry. After all, taking on a big hedge fund manager will make a prosecutor's career. What's more, short sellers might be the least sympathetic group of people imaginable. If politicians think jobs in their districts are at risk due to a short seller raid, they will act. Which means we might actually see criminal charges, but comment down below what you think is going to come out of all this. Make sure to check out all these other videos to catch up on all the latest AMC Stock DD and information you need.